Hi everyone, I would like to show you how to use a business rule task in Komunda and run a DMN decision with inputs and outputs. So let's start. So the first thing you have to do is download the Komunda starter initial uh, initial starter from start.komunda.com and open that in IntelliJ and convert the task that is uh, already present in that into a business rule task next in the modeler open uh, create a new dmn and in the dmn you have a dmn decision create a new decision and then two inputs so in this task what we are trying to do is add some inputs uh, and then <clears throat> let's say you have a number of guests uh, you have the season given the season given the number of guests what kind of food should be prepared that's the decision we have to take so that's the simple example which i've got from the commander docs commander 7 docs so this is the decision requirements diagram so you need current season which is the input and number of guests which is also an input and the decision requirements also and the DMN decision and if you click on the table here it will show you the complete uh, inputs and the rules so if you go on click on the first input the first input expression is current season that's that will be the name of the variable expression language is field and type is string the second input is number of guests that's the name of the variable expression language is field and type is integer so and there will be a list of results which will always be in the string format it will give you an output what kind of dish should be prepared so these are the different rules and these are the inputs so when season and number of guests then dish so these are the different rules and the input clause season and another input clause number of guests. So if you go to the process.bpmn, uh, uh, you can go to the implementation, it's called, it's a DMN. So since it's a business rule task, you have to implement it as a DMN and the decision reference is dish. So the dish is the name of uh, the so the dish is the ID of the D, uh, D, DMN. So now let's go to okay uh, again to the properties of this DM, business rule task. Binding is latest. We can also say deployment version version type. You can give the different versions if you want. And the result variable you can call it as uh, result variable uh, if this is uh, optional you can just take out the result from here we have the name as desired dish and you can just uh, print that or you can take that for your output and the output can be a single entry uh, a single result or uh, collect entries if multiple rules are, uh, are are valid then it will collect a list of objects and if uh, multiple rules are uh, are, are actually uh, matching then it will multiple lines are matching then it will be a list of map string objects so now let's show you i'll show you how to run this so first I will start the process. I am implementing a command line runner and um, I am also printing the result here using print result. So the command line runner runs with the starting variables current season, variables to put current season and fall, variables to put number of guests is 7. So this should be a map of string and object, uh, string, comma object and put that in the variables and start the process this is the name of the process is dmn process so let's go to the decision table and let's say winter 
current season is winter and number of guests is two what should be the result it should be roast beef so let me print print out the result so it print, prints out the result correctly so in field you can also have this expression inside a square brackets which means 5 to 8 including 5 and 8 so let's say spring season is spring and let's have 6 guests what will be the result it should be steak Okay, fall, winter and spring. In this case, you will consider any of the inputs and if the number of guests are number more than 8, then it will print stew, spring, let's say 9. So, okay, so that's correct now let's say yeah so this concludes the uh, simple example of a dmn decision using a business rule task